Hello, I'm Mark and I collect things. Sometimes I even play things and I'm always here spending too much time and money on collectibles. Today we're going to be opening a Hero DC Unlock the Multiverse Chapter 2 Mega Box. This box contains 24 packs. Each pack should have five of the main Unlock the Multiverse cards and then two of the Black Adam movie tie-in cards. Here are the pack odds. This adds up to 100%. To get the actual per pack pull rate, I think we need to multiply by seven, which is how many cards are in the pack, but I still need to do the math and make a video about that. This is my fifth Hero Mega Box opening on my channel. If you'd like to see more Hero pack openings or videos and content about collectibles and digital collectibles, I encourage you to consider liking and subscribing. That helps me to determine if I should invest more time and effort into making this type of content. All right, let's get right into this box. We'll start on the right side. This is pack number one. Superior, common, uncommon, common, common, uncommon, and an epic. Right, on to pack number two. Superior, uncommon, common, 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 superior, and epic. Superman versus Wraith. On to pack number three. As always, we are looking for mythics and low mint numbers. Uncommon, common, superior, uncommon, uncommon, common, and epic. With a three-digit mint, A313, that is a great mint number on this one. We'll count that as a pull for this box. Right, on pack four, no legendary yet. Should be getting one any moment now. Superior, common, uncommon, common, common, uncommon, and another epic, Batman Earth 52. All right, pack five. Superior, uncommon, common, 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 superior, epic. All right, pack six. Let's see if we'll go six packs uh, without a legendary. They've been falling for me about one every six or seven packs. Uncommon, common, superior, really nice Black Manta Inks artwork. Uncommon, common, uncommon, and epic. Once again, even though this looks kind of gold, it only has four bars at the bottom left, so this is epic rarity. It's gold because it's from the Black Adam portion of the set. All right, pack number seven. Common Red Hood, decent mint number, 2320. Common, uncommon, superior, common, superior, 
and epic. Pack number eight. Common, House of Mystery. Uncommon. Common, Justice League, Satellite. Kind of a cool mint. It's a palindrome. 9119. The Joker Superior. Uncommon. Common. And there's our first legendary of the box, Dr. Light. 21,471 as the mint number. All right. This should be pack number nine. Common, uncommon, common, uncommon, common, common, and epic. And this was one of those packs where we only got one of the Black Adam movie cards. Okay. Pack number 10. Superior. Uncommon, decent mint, 3603. Common, a common lighthouse. Uncommon, uncommon, and Dr. Fate, epic. Pack 11. Superior, common, uncommon, common, common, superior, and epic. Pack number 12. This will be the halfway point of the box. Right, superior, common, uncommon, common, Common, Uncommon, and Lex Luthor. Very good mint on this one. 1278. That'll be good for the leaderboard. Go ahead and sleeve that and the Dr. Light that I previously pulled. Been some recent hero news about some quests and collector scores or some kind of point system that they are implementing. It sounds like they're also going to be adding burning to be able to earn points. So you can go into the app and do your daily quests, such as logging in, making trades and purchases, and you'll start earning points. And eventually maybe be able to burn things to also get points. If we're able to burn cards to then redeem those points for other cards. I think that could be a big deal. Um, it would help flesh out a lot of the $1 cards on the market. A lot of people have stock piles of chapter one and chapter two, some of these physical cards. So I think that's a good way to uh, bring some more value to those cards. Looking forward to see what they offer with that. All right, pack number one here from the left side. Uncommon, common, superior, fan favorite, Agatha Zorbados. Decent mint number though, 3,544. Common, common, 2,500 in the mint, 2,561, pretty good. I always love getting these movie cards with low mints because they have such high print runs compared to the main set. Uncommon and epic. Batman versus the Joker. Pack two from the left. Uncommon. Common. Uncommon. Another good low four digit, 1416. Getting lots of good four digit mints in this box. Superior. 
Superior, Common, and Panel 6 Epic. Pack 3 from the left. Common, Uncommon, Common, Superior, Common, really high mint number, 183,000. Uncommon, and New Gods, Epic. Pack number four from the left. Common Toy Man, Uncommon, Common, Uncommon, Common, Su uh, Superior, and there's a legend from the Black Adam set. This Black Adam, let's see this, the print quality on these cards that have a lot of black is a little lacking at times, so we can see some line, horizontal lines, and also up here something is going on, didn't quite print right. It's a little bit of a bummer on these cards. They're well designed. I think they're great looking cards. Um, it's just unfortunate that the print quality on some of them is not quite as good as it could be. Go ahead and sleeve that one up. All right, pack number five on the left side. Crime Alley, common. Superior, superior. Uncommon, uncommon, common. And All-Star Superman, epic. Pack number six on the left. Great, we have Common, the Shade. Common, Uncommon, 5,000 in the mint, 5,025. Superior, Common, Uncommon, 6,000, four digit. And panel three, another four digit in the four thousands. This box has had a ton of four digits. I'd like to get more three digits or maybe even a two or one digit. Pack seven on the left. We are on track with the legend cards though. Pulled three. I expect that we'll pull at least one more. Common. Uncommon. Lighthouse common. Uncommon. Common, Superior, and there's another legend, Supergirl. All right, so we have pulled four legends. Maybe we can get a fifth out of this box. That would be nice. And that was another pack where there was only one Black Adam card. Pack eight on the left. Superior, common, uncommon, common, 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 and epic. Pack nine on the left. Superman inks, I love this card. Great artwork. Really cool contrast and design. Superior, uncommon, common, common, uncommon, common, and Metalman Epic. Pack 10. All right, uncommon, superior. Common, uncommon, common, superior, 
and epic. Yet another pack with just one Black Adam card. Pack 11, this is our next to last pack. Uncommon, common, superior, common, uncommon, common, and epic. The Flash versus Tar Pit. All right, this is our final pack. Let's see if we can get another three digit or one of those six mythics. They're very tough to pull. I pulled two so far. I would like to pull a couple more. It'd be nice. Uncommon, common, superior, uncommon, common, uncommon. And what do we get in our last one? Epic. Flashpoint. Batman Thomas Wayne. All right, so that's it for this box. We were on track with what I'm expecting to pull from each box for the Legends. We did get four. We got one three-digit. Hoping for two, but we only found one. I never did sleeve that one. Go ahead and get a sleeve. A 313. Nice mint on that. Then one of the Black Adam movie legends with a little bit of printing issues. Dr. Light, Lex Luthor, great low mint number. This will help out a ton. And Supergirl. All right, that's it for this video. If you'd like to see more hero pack openings or other videos related to collectibles and digital collectibles, I encourage you to consider liking and subscribing. Thanks for watching and have a great day.